What characteristics do all fungi share? In the earliest classification systems, fungi were classified as plants. The first classification system to recognize fungi as a separate kingdom was proposed in 1784 researchers identified four characteristics shared by all fungi, fungi lack chlorophyll. The cell walls of fungi contain the carbohydrate chitin, the same tough material a crab shell is made of. Fungi are not truly multicellular since the cytoplasm of one fungal cell mingles with the cytoplasm of adjacent cells, fungi are heterotrophic eukaryotes. Unable to produce their own food from inorganic matter, while plants are autotrophic eukaryotes. What is cholesterol? Cholesterol belongs to the subclass of lipids known as steroids. Steroids have a unique chemical structure. They are built from four carbon-laden ring structures that are fused together. The human body uses cholesterol to maintain the strength and flexibility of cell membranes. Cholesterol is also the molecule from which steroid hormones and bile acids are built. What are adventitious roots? Adventitious roots, from the Latin term adventitious, meaning not belonging to are roots that form on organs other than roots, such as a leaf or stem. In some plants, adventitious roots are a means of vegetative propagation such as for raspberries, apples, and cabbage. What is the status of the African elephant? From 1979 to 1989 Africa lost half of its elephants from poaching and illegal ivory trade. With the population decreasing from an estimated 1.3 million to 600,000. This led to the transfer of the African elephant from threatened to endangered status in October 1989 by sites. The Convention on International Trade in Endangered Species An ivory ban took effect on January 18, 1990. Botswana, Namibia and Zimbabwe have agreed to restrict the sale of ivory to a single, government-controlled center in each country. All countries have further pledged to allow independent monitoring of the sale, packing, and shipping process to ensure compliance with all conditions. Finally, all three countries have promised that all net revenues from the sale of ivory will be directed back into elephant conservation for use in monitoring, research, law enforcement, other management expenses, or community-based conservation programs within elephant range. What effect does aspirin have on enzymes?
Aspirin is probably the most common over-the-counter medication. Aspirin blocks the production of cyclooxygenase, COX, enzymes. COX-1 and COX-2 are two important enzymes with different functions. COX-1 catalyzes the biosynthesis of hormones important in maintaining the stomach lining. COX-2 catalyzes the biosynthesis of chemicals that promote inflammation, fever, and pain when an injury occurs. The positive effects of aspirin, pain and inflammation reduction, are due to the blocking of COX-2 enzymes. However, the negative aspects of aspirin, stomach problems, are due to the blocking of COX-1 enzymes. What are killer bees? Africanized honeybees the term entomologists prefer rather than killer bees are a hybrid originating in Brazil. Where African honeybees were imported in 1956. The breeders. Hoping to produce a bee better suited to producing more honey in the tropics. Instead found that African bees soon hybridized with and mostly displaced the familiar European honeybees. Although they produce more honey, Africanized honeybees, Apis mellifers cutellida, also are more dangerous than European bees because they attack intruders in greater numbers. Since their introduction they have been responsible for approximately 1,000 human deaths. In addition to such safety issues, concern is growing regarding the effect of possible hybridization on the U.S. beekeeping industry. In October 1990 the bees crossed the Mexican border into the United States. They reached Arizona in 1993. In 1996, six years after their arrival in the United States, Africanized honeybees could be found in parts of Texas, Arizona, New Mexico, Nevada, and California. Their migration northward has slowed. Partially because they are a tropical insect and cannot live in colder climates. Experts have suggested two possible ways of limiting the spread of the Africanized honeybees. The first is drone flooding, a process by which large numbers of European drones are kept in areas where commercially reared European queen bees mate, thereby ensuring that only limited mating occurs between Africanized drones and European queens. The second method is frequent requeening, in which a beekeeper replaces a colony's queen with one of his or her own choosing. The beekeeper can then be assured that the queens are European and that they have already mated with European drones. How do fish swimming in a school change their direction simultaneously? The movements of a school of fish, which confuse predators, happen because the fish detect pressure changes in the water. The detection system, called the lateral line, is found along each side of the fish's body. Along the line are clusters of tiny hairs inside cups filled with a jelly-like substance. If a fish becomes alarmed and turns sharply, it causes a pressure wave in the water around it. This wave pressure deforms the jelly in the lateral line of nearby fish. 
The deformation moves the hairs that trigger nerves. And a signal is sent to the brain telling the fish to turn. What is an exon? An exon is a segment of the transcript that is tied together with other exons by the spliceosome to make the mRNA molecule. After the exons are spliced together, they exit the nucleus for the cytoplasm, where the mRNA is translated into a polypeptide. Which tree species from the United States have lived the longest? Of the 850 different species of trees in the United States, the oldest species is the bristle cone pine, Pinus longava. This species grows in the deserts of Nevada and Southern California, particularly in the White Mountains. Some of these trees are believed to be over 4,600 years old. The potential lifespan of these pines is estimated to be 5,500 years. But potential age of the bristle cone pine is very young when compared to the oldest surviving species in the world, the maiden hair tree, Ginkgo biloba, of China. This species of tree first appeared during the Jurassic era, some 160 million years ago. Also called Ico, or the Ginkyo, meaning silver apricot. This species has been cultivated in Japan since 1100 BCE. How does one distinguish between thorns, spines, and prickles? Thorns are modified branches or stems arising from the axils of leaves. One purpose of thorns is to protect the plant from grazing animals. Hawthorn trees are an example of a plant with true thorns. Spines are modified leaves such as those found on cactus plants. Prickles are sharp outgrowths from the epidermis of various plant structures including leaves and stems. What bird has the biggest wingspan? Three members of the albatross family, the wandering albatross, Diomede exculens, the royal albatross, Diomede epomophora, and the Amsterdam island albatross, Diomeda amsterdiamensis have the greatest wingspan of any bird species with a spread of 8 to 11 feet, 2.5 to 3.3 m. What is the importance of an external egg in reproduction? Species that have an external egg usually produce a greater number of zygotes. Because mating between males and females is not required for successful reproduction. The external egg of most species has a leathery outer covering to prevent desiccation.
What is the best soil pH for growing plants? Nutrients such as phosphorus, calcium, potassium, and magnesium are most available to plants when the soil pH is between 6.0 and 7.5. Under highly acidic, low pH, conditions. These nutrients become insoluble and relatively unavailable for uptake by plants. However, some plants such as rhododendrons grow better in acidic soils. High soil pH can also decrease the availability of nutrients. If the soil is more alkaline than pH 8, phosphorus, iron, and many trace elements become insoluble and unavailable for plant uptake. When were bacteriophages first discovered? Bacteriophages were discovered in the early 1900s by Frederick W. Tort, 1877 to 1950, a British scientist, and Felix D. Harrell, 1873 to 1949 a French scientist. In 1915 Tort reported observing a filterable agent that destroyed bacteria growing on solid media. D. Harrell independently confirmed the discovery in 1917. It was actually D. Harrell who named the agent bacteriophage. However, very few scientists accepted these findings and the work on the growth and infectious nature of bacteriophages. It was not until the 1930s that Martin Schlesinger, a German biochemist, characterized bacteriophages, establishing their own unique place in the microbial world. How do elephants find each other across the savanna? Although elephants are well known for the trumpeting calls that they make when angry or disturbed, they are also capable of using ultrasound, sounds above the range of human hearing. And infrasound, sounds below the range of human hearing, to communicate with one another. Researchers have concluded that elephants may be able to hear ultrasonic calls from as far away as 2.5 miles 4 kilometers. In contrast, it is estimated that an infrasonic call by a male Elephant could in fact cover an area of 11.6 square miles 30 square kilometers. What technique may be used to determine the presence and concentration of various chemicals in a solution? Spectrophotometry is based on the principle that every different atom, molecule, or chemical bond absorbs a unique pattern of wavelengths of light. Using a spectrophotometer, scientists are able to measure the amount of light that is absorbed or transmitted by molecules in solution. This value of this measurement allows scientists to identify the chemical. What is the relationship between lichens and air pollution?
Lichens are extremely sensitive to pollutants in the atmosphere and can be used as bioindicators of air quality. They absorb minerals from the air, from rainwater, and directly from their substrate. Lichen growth has been used as an indicator of air pollution, especially sulfur dioxide. Pollutants are absorbed by lichens, causing the destruction of their chlorophyll, which leads to a decrease in the occurrence of photosynthesis and changes in membrane permeability. Pollutants upset the physiological balance between the fungus and the alga or cyanobacterium. And degradation or destruction of the lichens results. Lichens are generally absent in and around cities, even though suitable substrates exist. The reason for this is the polluted exhaust from automobiles and industrial activity. They are beginning to disappear from national parks and other relatively remote areas that are becoming increasingly contaminated by industrial pollution. The return of lichens to an area frequently indicates a reduction in air pollution. Do all cells require oxygen? Not all cells require oxygen. There are cells that use a metabolic pathway called fermentation to produce energy. Examples of anaerobic, non-oxygen dependent. Organisms include yeast and bacteria that are able to thrive in an environment with low levels of oxygen. However, the majority of organisms are aerobic. Oxygen dependent, because of the high ATP yield that oxygen provides. ATP is the main energy source for cells. Under some circumstances, oxygen dependent cells can harvest energy from fermentation for short periods of time. However, this shortcut eventually results in a buildup of a lactic acid a toxic waste product, and produces little ATP. What is the optimum thickness for specimens to be examined under a microscope? Biological and medical techniques require specimens of 1 to 50 micrometers. With the usual thickness being 4 to 5 micrometers for examination under a light microscope. Since an electron microscope has greater resolution. It requires thinner sections of 20 to 100 for biological specimens. Smear preparation is another standard technique used to prepare slides. What is an example of an antibiotic resistant pathogen? Staphylococcus aureus a bacterium that causes a variety of infections, including urinary tract infections and bacterial pneumonia, became resistant to penicillin 50 years ago. Stronger and more effective antibiotics have been developed to treat staph infections caused by the bacterium. What are the non-chylomates?
The nonchylomates are animals that lack a body cavity. A chylome, and include the sponges, jellyfishes, and simple worms. How deep does the root system penetrate the soil? The depth to which the root system penetrates the soil is dependent on moisture. Temperature, the composition of the soil, and specific plant. Most of the roots actively absorbing water and minerals. The feeder roots, are found in the upper 3 feet 1 meter of the soil. The feeder roots of many trees are mainly in the upper 6 in. 15 centimeters, of the soil the part of the soil richest in organic matter. What toxic substances are produced by mushrooms? The most toxic substances produced by mushrooms are amatoxins and phallotoxins, both cyclopeptides. These toxins act by interfering with RNA and DNA transcription, inhibiting the formation of new cells. The toxins collect in the liver, ultimately leading to liver failure. What is scientific notation? Scientific notation allows scientists to manipulate very large or very small numbers. It is based on the fact that all numbers can be expressed as the product of two numbers. One of which is the power of the number 10, written as the small superscript next to the number 10 and called the exponent. Positive exponents indicate how many times the number must be multiplied by 10 while negative exponents indicate how many time a number must be divided by 10. Which woods are recommended for construction when the wood will be constantly exposed to moisture? Decay-resistant woods such as redwood and cedar or wood treated with preservatives are recommended for use in construction when the wood will be exposed to moisture. The most effective and least toxic preservative is chromated copper arsenate, CCA. Lumber treated with CCA has a characteristic light green stain. Who decides which way a troop of monkeys will travel? Among savanna and gelata baboons, females form the stable social structure of the troops while males transfer between troops. Observations of gelata troops have shown that it is the females who Determine the direction the group will travel during the daily foraging trips. How do statin drugs affect cell function?
Statins are a group of drugs that work to lower cholesterol levels. Particularly the bad cholesterol, low-density lipoprotein known as LDL. The drugs work in two ways, one, they block an enzyme that is needed for cholesterol production. Two, they increase LDL membrane receptors in the liver. Cholesterol can only get into cells by binding to specific receptors that remove the LDL from blood. The extra receptors that statins create help decrease the cholesterol levels. As Americans become more aware that high cholesterol is a major risk factor for heart disease. Statins are becoming increasingly popular. How does water move up a tree? Water is carried up a tree through the xylem tissue in a process called transpiration. Constant evaporation from the leaf creates a flow of water from root to shoot. The roots of a tree absorb the vast majority of water that a tree needs. The properties of cohesion and adhesion allow the water to move up a tree regardless of its height. Cohesion allows the individual water molecules to stick together in one continuous stream. Adhesion permits the water molecules to adhere to the cellulose molecules in the walls of xylem cells. When the water reaches a leaf, water is evaporated. Thus allowing additional water molecules to be drawn up through the tree. What are GMO? GMO are genetically modified organisms that have been created using new techniques of recombinant DNA technology. However, the term is misleading because almost all domesticated animals and crop plants have been genetically modified over thousands of years by human selection and crossbreeding. GMO are viewed with concern because of public debate over the safety of the products and the fear that GMO foods represent a type of biological pollution. The battle has been particularly intense in Europe, where GMO have been banned since 1998. What movie was made about Diane Fossey's work with lowland gorillas? The movie Gorillas in the Mist was released in 1988. With actress Sigourney Weaver playing the role of Dion Fossey. The movie was filmed in Rwanda and Kenya and galvanized support for the plight of the gorillas. Why are ribosomes an important organelle? Ribosomes one of the most complex aspects of the molecular machine are the site of protein synthesis in a cell. They consist of a large and small subunit composed of ribosomal RNA and protein. However, compared with membrane-bound organelles, ribosomes are tiny structures.
What is the origin of the name Hydra? Hydra, a well-known member of phylum Nadaria is a tiny 0.4 in or 1 cm in length, organism found in freshwater ponds. It exists as a single polyp that sits on a basal disc that it uses to glide around. It can also move by somersaulting. It usually has 6 to 10 tentacles, which it uses to capture food. Hydras reproduce both sexually and asexually, budding. Hydras are named after the multi-headed monster of Greek mythology. That was able to grow two new heads for each head cut off. When a hydra is cut into several pieces. Each piece is able to regrow all the missing parts and become a whole animal. Do seedless watermelons occur naturally? Seedless watermelon was first introduced in 1988 after 50 years of research. A seedless watermelon plant requires pollen from a seeded watermelon plant. Farmers frequently plant seeded and seedless plants close together and depend on bees to pollinate the seedless plants. The white seeds, also known as pods. Found in seedless watermelons serve to hold a fertilized egg and embryo. Because a seedless melon is sterile and fertilization cannot take place. Pods do not harden and become a black seed, as occurs in seeded watermelons. What is amber? Amber is the fossilized resin of trees. Resin is the sticky material often seen oozing from the trunk of a pine tree. Resin hardens as it dries and is the source of both turpentine and rosin. Resin comes primarily from cowrie pine forests. The translucent material emerges from trees and forms lumps that appear deep orange or yellow in color. These lumps may weigh up to 99 pounds 45 kilograms. The two major deposits of amber are in the Baltic region and the Dominican Republic. Amber has also been found in the central Appalachian region of the United States. Prehistoric insects have been so remarkably preserved in Amber that the pieces still contain the insect's intact DNA. Amber is the only jewel of plant origin. How many different species of protists are known? Biologists estimate there may be as many as 200,000 species of protists. What is a chromosome map? A chromosome map lists the sequence of genes found on a given chromosome. Chromosome maps are usually determined by breeding experiments in which the ratio of the offspring 
with certain combinations of traits indicates how far apart those traits are on the chromosome. How can genes be silenced? Genes can be silenced either by preventing their transcription or by interference with their transcript. Gene silencing is a method by which researchers can study gene expression. How do elements differ from one another? Distinguishing one element from another requires a look at the subatomic particles of an atom the protons, neutrons, and electrons. Each element has a specific number of protons. This number is used to ascribe an atomic number to an element. All atoms have an equal number of protons and electrons. For example, an atom of helium has an atomic number of 2 because it has 2 protons. And therefore 2 electrons. An atom with an equal number of protons and electrons, such as helium, has a net electrical charge of 0. Biome Summary What is a Klein? A Klein refers to geographic variation due to a gradient of climatic features. For example, a north-south gradient may include a range of temperature and a range of plant sizes. With taller plants at the southern end and shorter plants at the northern end. How do animals recognize each other? We know that animals can use scent, color, and sound to recognize individuals. And they may also be able to recognize other attributes as well. A recent study on sheep intelligence indicates that easily. Herded animals may be smarter than originally thought. The sheep were shown pictures of other sheep and were Subsequently rewarded if they moved toward a selected picture. The sheep learned which face produced a reward. Ultimately, it was shown that sheep were able to pick a selected picture 80% of the time and could remember up to 50 images for two years. What is the fastest snake on land? The black mamba, Dendroaspis polylipi, a deadly poisonous African snake that can grow up to 13 feet. 4M, in length, has been recorded reaching a speed of 7 miles per hour, 11 kilometers per hour. A particularly aggressive snake, it chases animals at high speeds. Holding the front of its body above the ground. What was the United States' first national park?
On March 1, 1872, an act of Congress signed by Ulysses S. Grant established Yellowstone National Park as the first national park. The action inspired a worldwide national park movement. What are some methods of asexual reproduction? Budding, fission, and fragmentation are methods of asexual reproduction. In budding a new individual begins as an outgrowth, or bud, of the parent. Eventually, the bud detaches from the parent and develops into a new individual. Budding is common among sponges and coalendorates such as hydras and anemones. Fission is the division of one individual into two or more individuals of almost equal size. Each new individual develops into a mature adult. Some corals reproduce by dividing longitudinally into two smaller but complete individuals. Fragmentation is the breaking of the parent into several pieces. It is accompanied by regeneration when each piece develops into a mature individual. Sea stars are well known for reproducing by fragmentation and regeneration. What emotions do animals have? Many pet owners say that they know when their animal is happy or sad. And now there is evidence to show that animals do exhibit emotion. Researchers have found that emotions are accompanied by biochemical changes in the brain that can be measured. When scientists examine the physiological changes found in humans that correlate with certain emotional states, e. g. anger, fear, lust, they find that these changes can also be observed in certain animal species. A study of stress among African baboons showed that social behavior, personality, and rank within the troop can influence the levels of stress hormones. There is increasing evidence that birds, reptiles, and fishes also experience some form of emotions. Although the idea of animals feeling emotions raises skepticism, Students of animal behavior agree that many creatures experience fear, which is largely instinctive and, in effect, is pre-wired into the brain. Field observations have recorded expressions that correlate with pleasure, play, grief, and depression. Jane Goodall, watching the reaction of a young chimp after the death of his mother, maintains that the animal died of grief. Even with this evidence, it is impossible to truly know how another organism feels. What are organelles? Organelles frequently called little organs are found in all eukaryotic cells. They are specialized, membrane-bound, cellular structures that perform a specific function. Eukaryotic cells contain several kinds of organelles, including the nucleus. Mitochondria, chloroplasts, endoplasmic reticulum, and Golgi apparatus.
What are the uses of peat moss? Peat moss, genus Sphagnum, grows mostly in bogs. Peat moss is favored by gardeners for its ability to increase the water holding capacity of soils. Due to large, dead cells in the leaf like parts, it is able to absorb five times as much water as cotton plants. Peat moss is also used as damp cushions by florists to keep other plants and flowers damp. Species of sphagnum also have medicinal purposes. Certain aboriginal people use peat moss as disinfectants and, due to its absorbency, as diapers. Peat moss is acidic and is an ideal dressing for wounds. During World War I the British used more than one million wound dressings made of peat moss. Native North Americans used species of the Generineum and Bryum to treat burns. In Europe species of the genus Dichronoesia have been used to waterproof roofs. Which bryophytes are most closely related to green algae? Hornworts are more closely related to green algae than to any other group of plants. Hornwort cells usually have a single, large chloroplast with a pyrenoid. Granular, starch-containing body, similar to those of green algae. Mosses and liverworts are like all other plants because they have many dish-shaped chloroplasts per cell. How quickly do bacteria reproduce? In a favorable environment, bacteria can reproduce very rapidly. Favorable circumstances include laboratory cultures or the natural habitat. For example, under optimal conditions, Escherichia coli can divide every 20 minutes. A laboratory culture started with a single cell can produce. A colony of 107 to 108 bacteria in about 12 hours. What is the Hardy Weinberg theorem? The Hardy-Weinberg theorem, formulated in 1909, extends Mendel's laws to natural 392 populations. It explains in a formula what happens to the allelic end. Genotypic frequencies as alleles are passed between generations. The Hardy-Weinberg equilibrium is based on the following assumptions, 1. The population size is large. 2. Individuals mate randomly within the population. 3. There are no mutations. 4. There is no input of new alleles from outside sources. And 5. There is no natural selection. Such that each new allelic combination has equal chances of survival. Where does rain come from? Solar energy drives winds that evaporate water from the surface of the oceans. 
the water vapor cools as it rises and then falls to the ground as rain. Snow, or some other form of precipitation. Rain is part of the hydrologic cycle, which describes dynamic changes in the aquatic environment. What are the properties of cork that make it ideal for a variety of commercial uses? Cork consists of densely packed cells, about 1 million cells per cubic centimeter. That contain the plant wax suberin, making cork impermeable to liquids and gases. Half of its volume is trapped air. Therefore, it is four times lighter than water. It is virtually indestructible, fire resistant. And durable, resists friction, and absorbs vibration and sound. Among corks uses are as stoppers for wine bottles. Insulation for the space shuttle and grips on symphony conductors' batons. What is X-ray crystallography? X-ray crystallography, also called X-ray diffraction, is used to determine crystal structures by interpreting the diffraction patterns formed when X-rays are scattered by the electrons of atoms in crystalline solids. X-rays are sent through a crystal to reveal the 534 pattern in which the molecules and atoms contained within the crystal are arranged. Are any bacteria visible to the naked eye? Epilopiscium fishelsoni, which lives in the gut of the brown surgeon fish. Acanthurus nigrofuscus, is visible to the naked eye. It was first identified in 1985 and mistakenly classified as a protozoan. Later studies analyzed the organism's genetic material and proved it to be a bacterium of unprecedented size. 0.015 in, 0.38 millimeters, in diameter, or about the size of a period in a small print book. What are telomeres and where are they located? Telomeres are protective structures composed of DNA that contain multiple repetitions of one short nucleotide sequence instead of genes. They are found at each end of a eukaryotic chromosome. What is the role of yeast in beer production? Beer is made by fermenting water, malt, sugar, hops, yeast, species Saccharomyces spp. Salt and citric acid. Each ingredient has a specific role in the creation of beer. Malt is produced from a grain usually barley that has sprouted, been dried in a kill, and ground into a powder. 
Malt gives beer its characteristic body and flavor. Hops is made from the fruit that grows on the herb Humulus lupulus, a member of the mulberry family. The fruit is picked when ripe and is then dried, this ingredient gives beer a slightly bitter flavor. Yeast is used for the fermentation process. Making beer is a complex process. One method begins by mixing and mashing malted barley with a cooked cereal grain such as corn. This mixture, called word, is filtered before hops is added to it. The word is then heated until it is completely soluble. The hops is removed, and after the mixture has cooled, yeast is added. The beer ferments for 8 to 11 days at temperatures that range between 50 degrees and 70 degrees Fahrenheit, 10 degrees and 21 degrees Celsius. The beer is then stored and kept at a state that is close to freezing. During the next few months the liquid takes on its final character before carbon dioxide is added for effervescence. The beer is then refrigerated, filtered, and pasteurized in preparation for bottling or canning. Are turtles endangered? Worldwide turtle populations have declined due to several reasons including habitat destruction, exploitation of species by humans for their eggs, leather, and meat, and they're becoming accidentally caught in the nets of fishermen. In particular danger are sea turtles, such as Kemp's Ridley sea turtle, Lepidoshellus kempii, which is believed to have a population of only a few hundred. Other threatened species include the Central American River Turtle, Dermatemis maywii, the Green Sea Turtle, Chelonia mitas, the Leatherback Sea Turtle, Geochelone inifora, the Desert Tortoise, Gophera sagacezii, and the Galapagos Tortoise, Geochelone elephantopus. Source, U.S. How do brain cells store memories? The part of your brain responsible for processing memory is the hippocampus. It is believed that memories are formed at the level of individual nerve cells. The synapse is the point at which adjoining nerve cells touch, and it is this juncture that is the building block of memory systems. Information moves across the synapse the information signal is carried inside a cell by a second messenger, known as cyclic amp, which then activates other cell machinery. The end result is the switching on of a gene that regulates memory. The product of the gene, a protein, promotes synaptic growth and can convert short-term memory to long-term memory. What is spectroscopy? Spectroscopy includes a range of techniques to study the composition, structure, and bonding of elements and compounds. The different methods of spectroscopy use different wavelengths of the 
electromagnetic spectrum to study atoms, molecules, ions, and the bonding between them. How do fungi cause trees to become hollow? Trees with hollow interiors are a familiar sight in parks, forests, and throughout urban areas. Fungal decay is often the cause of the hollowing of the trees. Wood decaying fungi can enter a tree following a wound to the tree. The tree will produce a band of cells that tries to resist the formation of decay directly around the wound. The fungus that has entered the tree through the wood will continue to decay the inner lichens. Like the yellow lichen shown here, are often used as natural dyes and in the perfume and cosmetic industries. Wood while the wood protected by the band of cells will continue to be sound. Hollow trees are also formed by fungi that solely attack the hardwood of a tree, this is most commonly observed in older coniferous trees of the Pacific coast of North America, reaching from California to Alaska. Heart rot fungi can enter a tree either through a wound or through small branch stubs. It decays the inner wood, resulting in a weak tree that is susceptible to damage by strong winds. What value do liverworts have ecologically? Liverworts provide food for animals. Due to their ability to retain moisture. They also assist in the decay of logs and aid in the disintegration of rocks into soil. How can biotechnology be used to manufacture vaccines? Vaccine development is risky using conventional methods because vaccines must be manufactured inside living organisms. And the diseases themselves are extremely dangerous and infectious. Using genetic engineering, specific pathogen proteins that trigger antibody. Production are isolated and inserted into a bacterial or fungal vector. The organisms are then cultured to produce large quantities of the protein. Which species of tree are highly resistant to fungal decay and which are highly susceptible? In general, black locust, walnut, white oak, cedar. And black cherry trees are highly resistant to fungal decay. Species that are highly susceptible to fungal decay include 156 aspen, willow, silver maple, and American beech trees. How many acres of wetlands have been lost in the United States? Since access to water is important to industrial development. Many cities are located in areas including wetlands. In the urbanization process, wetlands have been drained, filled, or used as dumps. 
Each wetland area serves as a habitat to many different plants and animals. With special regard to spawning and nursery habitats. The Wetlands Restoration Act, H.R. 1474, enacted November 29, 1990. Refers to wetland MIT Igashin Banking and provides that any person who discharges dredged or fill material into the waters of the United States must have a permit from the Army Corps of Engineers. This act is an attempt to preserve the complex communities that are found within wetlands. Wetlands are the lands between aquatic and terrestrial areas. Such as bogs, marshes, swamps, and coastal waters. Although wetlands were at one time considered wastelands. Scientists now recognize the importance of wetlands to improve water quality, stabilize water levels. Prevent flooding, regulate erosion, and sustain a variety of organisms. The United States has lost approximately 100 million acres of wetland areas between colonial times and the 1970s. The 1993 Wetlands Plan established a goal of reversing the trend of 100,000 acres of wetland loss to 100,000 acres of wetland recovery. What do truffles look like? Truffles have a rather unappealing appearance. They are somewhat round, but irregularly shaped. And have thick, rough, wrinkled skin that varies from off-white to almost black in color. The fruiting bodies present on truffles are fragrant, fleshy structures that usually grow to about the size of a golf ball. They range from white, gray, or brown to nearly black in color. There are nearly 70 known varieties of truffles, but the most desirable is the black truffle also. Known as black diamond that grows in France's Perigord and Corsi regions as well as Italy's Umbria region. The flesh of the black diamond appears to be black. But it is actually dark brown, and contains white striations. The flesh has an aroma that is extremely pungent. The second most popular is the white truffle actually off-white or beige, of Italy's Piedmont region. Both the aroma and flavor of this truffle are earthy and garlicky. Fresh truffles are available from late fall to midwinter. And can be stored in the refrigerator for up to three days. What setbacks have occurred in the use of gene therapy? During the 1990s there were more than 4,000 patients involved in gene therapy trials. Unfortunately, most of these trials were not successful. And a further setback occurred in 1999 with the death of 18-year-old Jesse Gelsinger. Gelsinger suffered from ornithine transcarbamylase deficiency. A rare metabolic disease in which toxic levels of ammonia can be produced by the liver. He died of complications due to a severe immune response to the viral carrier used to deliver the therapeutic genes.
How can animal behavior be categorized? Animal behavior can be sorted into broad categories, e. g. courtship, feeding, or into more specific patterns, example attack, chase, aggressiveness. What is the oldest known fossil flower? The fossil of the world's earliest known flower was discovered in 1986. This flowering plant is from the 120 million year old Kunwara fossil beds found near Melbourne, Australia. The fossil flower was an important find because all the parts of the flower were attached to an intact plant. The fossil resembles a small black pepper plant, less than 1 in, 3 centimeters, long. Paleobotanists believe that this plant represents an ancestral type of flower. How long have cockroaches been on the earth? The earliest cockroach fossils are about 280 million years old. Cockroaches, order Dictyoptera, are nocturnal scavenging insects that eat not only human food but book bindings, ink, and whitewash as well. What are chiasmata? The site of crossing over, where homologous chromosomes actually exchange material during the first round of meiosis, is known as a chiasma. The plural version is chiasmata. What is homology? Homology is the similarity in traits between two species that is indication of their common ancestry. For example, the general characteristics of cheetahs, lions, tigers, and house cats are whiskers retractable claws, tooth structure, and so forth. These similarities indicate that each of these traits was inherited from a feline ancestor. What is a bioreactor? A bioreactor is a large vessel in which a biological reaction or transformation occurs. Bioreactors are used in bioprocessing technology to carry out large-scale mammalian cell culture and microbial fermentation. What is cognition? Cognition is the highest form of learning, and consists of the perception, storage, and processing of information gathered by sensory receptors.
What is the largest group of mollusks? The gastropods, class gastropoda, which include snails, slugs, and their relatives, is the largest and most diverse group of mollusks. It includes more than 40,000 different species and comprises the second largest group of related animals. Only the insects comprise a larger group. Most gastropods are marine animals, but there are many freshwater species. Garden snails and slugs have adapted to land. What is the composition of urine? Urine is composed mostly of water containing organic wastes as well as some salts. The composition of urine can vary according to diet, time of day, and diseases. In one measure, the makeup of urine is 95% water and 5% solids. In terms of organic wastes, per 1500 ml, urine contains 30 g of urea. 1 to 2 g each of creatinine and ammonia, and 1 g of uric acid. In terms of salts or ions, 25 g per 1500 ml of urine contain the positive ion sodium, potassium, magnesium, and calcium, as well as the negative ions chlorides, sulfates, phosphates. How did the increased level of radioactive dust? Cesium-137 In lichens affect the food chain following the Chernobyl nuclear power station disaster? Lichens are a primary source of food for reindeer. Reindeer is commonly consumed by humans that live in regions of tundra. When the accumulated level of radioactive dust present in lichens became so high in the reindeer that fed off of them. The reindeer meat became unsuitable for human consumption. Hundreds of tons of reindeer carcasses were disposed of as toxic waste. What is the largest invertebrate? The largest invertebrate is the giant squid, Archytothes ducks, which averages 30 to 53 feet, 9 to 16 m, in length including its tentacles. It may reach a length of 69 feet 21 meters. These animals have the largest eyes, up to 10 in, 25 centimeters, in diameter, in the animal kingdom. It is believed that they generally live on or near the ocean bottom at a depth of 3,281 feet. 1,000 m or slightly more than a half mile below the surface of the sea. Do animals marry? It is estimated that 90% of bird species are monogamous that is. One male mates with one female to produce offspring. 
some of these pair bonds may actually extend beyond a single mating season and so could be considered a form of marriage. The type of pair bonds a species will form is dependent on their ecological niche and is heavily influenced by the needs of their offspring. Altricial offspring, which require large amounts of parental care for survival, like humans. Demand the efforts of two parents and therefore are more likely to be found in monogamous species. How do fungi reproduce? Fungal reproduction occurs in two different ways sexually or asexually. Asexual reproduction occurs through fission, budding, or most commonly by spore formation. Sexual reproduction occurs by means that are characteristic for each group. Two types of reproductive structures are found in fungi. Sporangia produce spores. Whereas gametangia produce gametes. In order to sexually reproduce, fungi often carry out some type of conjugation. Hyphae of two genetically different mating types come together and fuse, forming a diploid zygote. Most fungi reproduce sexually with nuclear exchange rather than gametes. Do animals ever help each other? Populations of organisms within an environment may engage in a variety of relationships with each other. For example, in a relationship known as mutualism, each species provides a benefit to the other. Mutualism can occur between two animal species like the relationship between large coral reef fishes and the smaller species like the wrasses that swim into their mouths and eat the parasites that may have taken up residence there. Mutualistic relationships also allow bean plants to grow better because they exchange nutrients with rhizobium fungi living on their roots. 